Yo, what up YouTube? Rotocut Gaming here bringing you another cryptocurrency related video. And today it's a follow up to a video that I made, what, like five days ago, five, six days ago. I was excited. It's about the 3090. Uh, I've been me messing with it, toying with it, and trying to get the best settings for Ethereum. I think that's the most profitable coin that you can mine with it. Uh, so I just wanted to share some of the settings that I got, some of the um uh, my learnings the mega hash all that good stuff and you know we'll we'll just get right into it all right so here we go um so this is a screenshot that i took um earlier today i'm not mining with it right now obviously i'm using i'm using it to record this video uh, but as you can see i'm using the t-rex miner the latest version and i am getting 124.5.6 mega hash uh, uh, a second on the 3090. Um, I'm happy with the temperatures. Uh, I, I'm at 51 degrees Celsius on the core and 86 degrees Celsius on the memory junction temperature reading. Um, and I was expecting it to be like in the high 90s, 100. Uh, I only have a small little fan on top of it uh, on, on my main gaming main gaming computer. Uh, to dissipate some of that heat so super happy with it I didn't really have to do any modifications as far as thermal pads reseeding anything you know with with it I didn't have to break it open or open or whatever so I'm, I'm really happy with it um, this video card is a, a, a very power hungry video card and I'm running it at uh, 293 watts um, and that's basically at 70 percent power limit I got here a screenshot of my settings I haven't really messed with any core clocking, voltage locking, anything like that. This is just MSI afterburner. These are the settings that I'm running. 70% uh, uh, on the power limit. So that, that roughly puts it around 293 watts uh, that, it's, that it's utilizing while mining. And the core clock, I did up it to about 100, um, uh, plus 100 on the, mega, on the core. And on the memory clock, I did 1400. I messed with some of them. I think these are the best settings for my card. I was at 1500 and it was crashing. Um, and you know, 1300 and 1200, it, it didn't really give me that oomph that I wanted. So, you know, I'm, I was able to hone in on, on these settings for my particular card. It's the EVGA 3090 FTW3. So, um, uh, on the fan speed, I, I have it roughly at an 85%, but right now, for, I guess for the sake of the screenshot, it took it at 76, but uh, the fan speed, I think I have it at 85. It's not too loud. It's 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 okay. Um, and yeah, like I said, I'm using the new T-Rex Miner. Uh, this is the new GUI that it presents, and uh, starting from version, I think, 23 and on uh, upward, it's, uh, it's showing you that uh, this level of detail on it. And um, I, I think it's pretty neat, um, and I'll be, you know, utilizing this for analysis and, and trying to figure out, hey, am, am I getting what I'm supposed to be getting out of it? But um, no, nah, I mean, it, it looks pretty cool. On the What to Mine website, I uh, let me see. I already have the the 3090 selected here, um, and as you can see. Um, and these are averages, right, that the, the website is using and utilizing, I guess, uh, from, I don't know where they're getting their information from, from various people that report their, their settings and, and results. But, theoretically, the 3090 should be getting about 114 mega hash uh, with, a, with a usage of 320 watts. I'm beating it, obviously. Um, I'm getting 124 at 293 so look at the difference the difference is that this card should be making revenue i'm just for the sake of simplicity revenue uh seven 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 uh sixty six okay but if i put 124 50, 60 and uh 293 it's gonna go from this to that so quite a quite a difference actually um i can't look seven seven sixty six eight thirty seven so just the little overclocking setting and, and 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 honing in on your on your clocks is very bad for you in the long run that's a, a dollar oh what happened here uh that's a dollar 
um, a day over the course of 30 days is it a dollar uh, less than a dollar but let's say you know, it's 50 cents over the course of 30 days uh, 30 days hey that's 20 extra an extra 20 25 30 bucks depending right um, and it multiplies that's that's in today's money if, if it goes up two three times in the future that 20 bucks is actually 60 bucks so just just got to think long term and, and um, honing in on your on your clocks is really important um, and I think that's all I have. Just wanted to share the the settings that I have, uh, the mega hash that I'm getting. Um, I promised myself that I, I was going to record this video, so this is what I'm doing. And uh, appreciate you guys clicking on my video. Sorry about the little snafu. I think my video card um, acted up a, uh, a little bit. Got to figure out what that that's all about. Anyway, thanks a lot. See you on the next one. Peace.